Hi, Chris Hall here with South Dakota Game Fish and Parks. Came into the office on a Saturday, uh, snuck into my boss's office, shut the door, turned off the lights, got the light on the camera, because I, I kind of came up with an idea um, that I don't really have permission to do yet, but uh, I'm kind of excited about, and uh, it's regarding fishing and fishing in South Dakota. There isn't a person in South Dakota that doesn't live 5, 10, 15 minutes away from quality fishing. Um, you know, it might not always be a big giant stringer of walleyes or, or a big bucket full of jumbo perch or a stringer full of big northerns, but uh, they live next to quality fishing or close to quality fishing. Um, bluegills, perch, crappies, um, bass, uh, white bass, bullheads, catfish. It's all out there and, and it's all real close by. So I came up with this idea of the 20 minute angler. Um, you know, in these days, um, we don't always have all day to go out and fish and, and, and get in a boat and, and, and spend an, an entire day fishing. But we can get an hour here, um, a half hour there. And, and so I came up with this idea of the 20 minute angler. 20 minute angler being, um, you know, you're ready, you got gear close by, there's spots everywhere, we know that. And uh, just to take advantage of those things, to get outside, get outdoors, uh, fish. I don't know about you, but for me, if I can even spend a half hour, hour fishing, the act of fishing uh, just kind of keeps me on an even keel. So the 20 minute angler, uh, going to try to make them, keep them short, keep these uh, shows funny, keep them um, entertaining, hopefully, hopefully we're going to catch some fish, no promises there, um, but give you some tips on how to do these things, uh, what kind of tackle we'll be using. Uh, we're going to be featuring our new interactive uh, shore fishing and boating access map just to kind of highlight some of these areas that, that you might drive past every day uh, back and forth to work or back and forth to the ranch and uh, just to highlight those and show you that they do hold good fish and, and it can be entertaining. And uh, I know for me, having a three-year-old daughter, her attention span is only about 20 minutes, half hour anyway. So, uh, you know, we get out and enjoy it and when she's ready to go, I can go too and, and we can accept that. Um, so uh, I, I hope this, this works well, and I hope I get permission once uh, my bosses see it to uh, keep doing it. And uh, I think the first episode, we're going to hit Oahe Downstream Marina, uh, close to Pier. Um, the Game Fishing Park stocks trout there every year, and uh, we're going to go get after some trout. But uh, we're going to be doing a lot of them, hopefully there again, knock on wood. And uh, I hope you like them. Um, you know, feel free to submit your own episodes. We're going to be pushing that too. And uh, just get out and have fun. Uh, and enjoy the nature, um, you know, see the sights and enjoy the resources. So stay tuned. Uh, once again, we're keeping it down, dirty, quick and simple. We've got a couple of rods, one with a little cast master tied onto it, one with a hook and an adjustable casting bubble. Real cheap, easy to find. Gonna use some gulp. Got uh, just a small tackle box, a few hooks, a few weights. Uh, we're gonna throw about uh, 20 casts and uh, then get back. Finally. Finally, finally, finally. Three trips out here. Finally got one. Just, uh, my wife thinks I'm running an errand, but uh, took 20 minutes. Was that about nine casts? Had three fish on. No trout. Awesome. I'm gonna try to catch one more, and then I gotta get back before my wife is uh, wondering and calls the National Guard. Last cast. That's it. I love fishing.